hey everybody welcome back to my channel so in this video i'm going to be going through charcoal drawing tutorial for beginners in which you will learn how to draw face from scratch using all of the basic proportion and shading with charcoal as well so let me know if you want to see more sort of videos like this where i do it from scratch and take you through the whole process Anyways guys, let's talk about the tool first. So for charcoal drawing, you will need a grey tone paper, a Darwin dark charcoal pencil, a mechanical pencil or any graphite pencil, black pencil by Faber-Castell, a blending brushes, a jelly roll pen or any whitener for the highlights. And planting stump or any eraser which is an optional if you want to use it. Let's start the face drawing by using the basic proportion first. First of all I'm starting off with the two markings to represent the basic size that I want the face to be. Draw horizontal line and split it in half vertically and then with the bottom half split that in half again. The most important task in this step is to determine the shape and location of the eyes on the piece of paper. To do this, divide line into three equal sections, two for the eyes and one for the space between the eyes, because the between is also equal to the size of the eyes. Now the nose is going to be on the middle line on the lower half and the mouth is halfway through the iris that I haven't drew as yet. Anyways, we will look into more details later on. So now it's time to block in the facial details like drawing the iris, tear duct or adding eyelashes in the eyes etc along with the shadows and highlight details all over the face. So here I'm using a charcoal pencil dark by Darwin to adding up the shading layer and I'm doing it layer by layer along with the blending stub to really build it out smoothly. And then I'm using here a black pencil as well to make a combo with the charcoal pencil. Also I'm using here a black marker to adding up more darker values which is an optional one so to just make the upper eyelid more darker enough also i'm using here a jelly roll pen for adding up a sharper highlights you can use a pen connector or any whitener to adding up the highlights it's just like this Also using the same whitener or using an eraser for creating the highlights in the tear droplet. Now I'm using a blending brush to smoothen out all of the area around the eye and I'm going to repeat the same procedure on the, another eye by just starting off with the black pencil first and then I'll use the charcoal pencil as I have done before.
so for the nose I'm blocking in first the darkest area of the nose uh, which is a shadowed one and also the nostril or the lower part of the nose where the light is less present there So the best thing about the charcoal is that it doesn't create shine and can smudge more easily. So I'm using a soft transition with the help of charcoal and I'm smudging it with the tissue paper. Also I'm using here a jelly roll pen or any whitener for creating a highlight and to really make it look three dimensional. Also, I'm using a black pencil by Faber Castell to adjusting the darkness of the underneath the nose, and I'm blending out everything evenly with the tissue paper or the blending stuff. I'm using here the craft knife to erase the excessive whitener to create the desired shape of the highlight. So now moving on to the lips area which I already have uh, created a basic contour drawing. So with the help of black pencil I am creating uh, creases in the lip area and then I will smudge out with the tissue paper. And that's how I will build up more and more layers with the help of charcoal pencil. And I will build up some layers until I will satisfy with the result. Now I'm going to create a creases with the help of charcoal pencil and then I'll blend it out with the blending stump. Once I finish drawing the creases, now I'm going to use an eraser to pull up some of the highlights and I'm also going to use a pen corrector later on for creating a brighter highlights. Now I'm finalizing this minimalist charcoal drawing with some final touch-ups. Hope you enjoyed this video and get some value out of it. If you did, make sure to subscribe, like and comment down below. See you in the next video. Till then, bye!